going on, everybody? You already know who it is. It's your boy, Sean Bitter 618 And I'm back with something a little different. I know I usually do Jordans on this channel. But today, I had to get something special for y'all. As you can see, he's on TV now doing some goofy ass shit. As usual. We got the new Drake shoes in, man. He just basically just got a sponsorship with Nike. Uh, pretty much the first artist to ever do this. Uh, he has his own brand, Nocta. Um, we're going to go ahead and get into that. But before we get into that video... I need you guys to smash that like button. Make sure you guys subscribe to it as well. And don't forget to tap the notification bell while you're here. And uh, let's get into these shoes. Standing Unfortunately, on I've been so swamped with work, I haven't been able to do no shoe reviews or anything like that. But yeah, I had these for a little while. As you can see, they look dusty at the top. I done had it jumping everywhere. But I finally wanted to wear the shoes, so I'm going to go ahead and review them before I actually put them on my feet. Now, I went ahead and grabbed the Nocta Glides. Now, I believe these came out in May, earlier this year. I'm not sure. I'm not sure at all. But I did catch on to it this summer. Uh, when I first seen this shoe, I was like, them look like them old school Jason Kidd shoes that came out like in 96 or some shit like that. Um, and they looked exactly like that, especially with the alien looking eyes or whatever you want to call those things. But they are the knock the glides. When I seen them, I was like, these is pretty cool. I didn't know they were the Drake shoes until I did a little research on them. And then I realized, you know, read up on it, researched that it, they are Drake shoes. So introducing the knock the glides, man. Let's go ahead and get into the unboxing of the knock the glides. I, and I think it's pretty dope, man. Drake got his own shoe, got his own line, basically. He already had his own little shoes with Jordan and everything, but this is like his own official line. So I think that's pretty dope for an artist that uh, be able to break into that barrier and be able to be in that shoe world like that from shoe companies. All right, so eventually we're going to go ahead and start off from outside in. All right, so first thing I caught, I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. Hell no, man. What the fuck, man? Get your ass on, man. Stuff going on in the industry, but I don't know what that means. But it, you know, whatever. Three crosses. It got three crosses on this side. Maybe that's the logo. Um, CL right here. Don't even know what that means. AWR. I have to look that up. Not even sure what that means either. But yeah, size ten, of course. Uh, it's a basic box. Nothing special to the box. Just a basic brown box. Got the two tone color. Nike symbol right there as well. Yeah. All right. So open the box. You got your paper. Of course, we can blow a paper all this way. This shit been sitting in here for a while. Uh, but we finally got them out for you guys. So I can go ahead and show you guys what's going on with them. Okay. Now, one thing I will say, I haven't put my foot in these shoes at all. As you can see. But goddamn, they look pretty comfortable. Wouldn't lie to you if I, you know, they definitely look pretty comfortable. Um, yeah. We got the shoes. So these are the Drake Noctas, Nocta Glides. Um, I did see, I did see like three or four more colorways of these. Um, not really interested in all those colorways. They look smooth, they cool, but it's nothing I'd be going to like buy instantly. I did like the all white ones. They just recently came out, and then they got like the slime green. I don't know if those is out yet. And then they got some red ones too. Um, that recently came out not too long ago. But overall, the shoe is nice. Sorry about that. Overall, this shoe, overall the shoe is nice. Um, so I'm gonna start from the bottom on in. All right. So for the bottom, it's pretty grippy. They got your little yellow joints, whatever you want to call these. Little circle joints. They look like little alien pods or something like that. Uh, they got the carbon fiber right here, and you would think this is carbon fiber. Uh, it's more like a sold in weed type thing. Weave. Uh, it looks pretty good though. It's smooth. I like it. Um, I done seen some good reviews. I done seen some bad reviews on this shoe. Me personally, it's a shoe that I would definitely throw on if I'm just going to like brunch or lunch or something like that. Something smooth. Maybe a little Walmart run or something. I would definitely throw these on so I can stay clean and fresh at the same time. Uh, it does have Nike right here on the essence. Right here on the side. I like it. 
I think the shoe look dope. They got the cross. They're gonna wear crosses again. The shoe reminds me of Drake. I don't know if that makes sense, but it gives me a Drake vibe. That like this look like a shoe Drake would actually wear. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the shoe look dope though. But these is the eyelid. These are the eyes I was talking about that was on the Jason Kidd shoes. I feel like they kind of they kind of took that from that that idea from that and put it on here. The shoe is pretty much mesh. Like I said, I haven't put it on yet, but I'm pretty sure the shoe is comfortable. It comes with your normal little paper inside. Yeah, you got the knocker right there. Got the leather tab, silver leather tab. The shoe is pretty sturdy as well. It don't give me cheap vibes. Uh, the shoe was retailed at 140. I paid the 140 for them. So, I mean, it was a good steal for a shoe. I mean, this is definitely a beautiful summer shoe. And living in Las Vegas, the weather don't get too bad. So, you can pretty much rock these all year long. Um, if I had to rate the shoe, I would give the shoe this isn't his first shoe in that line. I think this is the second one. I believe it's the second one. But I rated it. I, I give it a, I give it an eight out of ten, maybe a seven and a half out of ten. Uh, the shoe was dope. Like I said, I seen some bad reviews on them, but I think the shoe is pretty dope. I don't know if this is considered a basketball shoe or not. I don't think you can hoop in these. I wouldn't hoop in these. It looks like you would break your ankle. But like I said, this looks like the perfect shoe if you want to throw on like a little Nike jumpsuit, Nike sweatsuit. Pop these on with them. You're going to be stiffy, man. I like them, though. They're pretty dope. Um, and they light. They're not that... Well, they kind of a little heavy. You would think they're a little lighter. They're a little heavier. They just got the regular shoe strings as well. Uh, but overall, dope shoe, man. I like the shoe. Like I said, I don't know if I'll be able to get any more out of that collection. It's nothing that I'll be thirsty to grab. But if I had to get another pair, it would either be the white ones or the slime green ones. I like the slime green ones. Those are pretty dope. But these shoes is dope, man. And I bought these off of GOAT. I got these off GOAT for uh, 150 I think, or 140 when they go to Texas store. Uh, but yeah, I went ahead and grabbed these off GOAT. They sold out online. You would have to grab them from one of those third-party retailers. Uh, because right now, Nike, I think they only have like two sizes. Like a size six, six, six and a half or something like that. But they pretty much sold out. Uh, so like I said, the shoe is dope. Uh, Best of luck to Drake on his new business venture with Nike. And uh, I'm really looking forward to seeing more shoes in the future from him. Um, and he also he also do have uh, clothes as well. His clothing line, I've seen the jacket. I've seen Drewski wearing one of the jackets and everything else like that. So he does have clothing line as well. So you can tap in with that on Nike.com. Um, and these are not OVOs. These are not considered OVO type releases. These are Drake's own brand with Nike. Like I said, I'm looking forward to wearing them. I, I really wanted to knock this video out so I can go ahead and rock the shoes because uh, I like the shoes. The weather is pretty smooth and I want to put these on today. So, yeah. Other than that, the shoes is dope. Make sure you guys go get you guys a pair if you into that shit. I got them just because they Drake's first pair of signature shoes, so I pretty much feel like that was going to be a dope shoe to get. But other than that, man, I want you guys to have a blessed day, sweet, smooth day. Um, enjoy your day. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and, uh, Run it up for me so I can give you guys more videos like this. I got a lot of shoes and I need to catch up on the reviews. All right, let's get it.